Earlier this month, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle visited the UK for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations. Tensions between the couple and the rest of the royal family are still very very frosty after reports that Harry is upset following their visit. Speaking on Australia's Today Show, the Daily Mirror's royal editor Russell Myers discussed the frosty relationships and Harry's fury. Mr. Myers said, if Harry's looking for some, sort of, piecemeal then he was a long way off that. Today's host Richard Wilkins replied, you can't have your cake and eat it too Russell, you know. One word, Oprah, the royal expert said, well, of course. The people I speak to, the palace every day, who, are, obviously very very well connected with the top players, as it were. Read more, Prince William and Kate's new Windsor home laid bare as family move near Frail Queen they are still absolutely furious. Mr. Myers added, you can't go on, you know, international television interview with Oprah Winfrey, complaining about your treatment with the family and then wanting to sit down with them when you're still giving interviews. Referring to the Duke of Sussex's recent interview with NBC Today, he continued, Harry was giving an interview just a couple of weeks ago when he was at the Invictus Games. It was all, sort of, bizarre language, he was there to protect the Queen and these things are not going down too well. If it, their relationship, is to be repaired, then there needs to be a bit more water under the bridge. Read more, hear more me. How fuming William vowed to pull out of royal event unless Andrew was blocked the couple sat down with Oprah for a televised bombshell interview in early 2021. During their interview, Meghan and Harry accused a member of the family, not the Queen or Duke of Edinburgh, of making a racist comment about their son, Archie. Other revelations in the interview included Harry's admission he had become estranged from his father, the Prince of Wales, saying I feel really let down, but added that he would make it one of his priorities to try and heal that relationship. Don't miss Meghan and Harry forced to back of procession to prevent photos, insight, William told how to approach Harry to avoid further embarrassment, analysis, Meghan Mackle and Harry were 50 minutes late not to be lumped video. Meghan also opened up about having suicidal thoughts whilst pregnant with their first child. She spoke about how she was denied help from within the institution during this time. Meghan and Harry, who traveled with their two children for the visit, flew back to the US before the Jubilee celebrations had concluded. Since their royal exit in 2020, the couple are now settled in California.